Hey guys, so I just wanted to do a quick update on the brine shrimp hatchery. Uh, as you can see, we have tons and tons of little brine shrimp that have hatched uh, from these little eggs. Uh, there's still actually a lot of eggs that didn't hatch. And I know I said let's check back in 24 hours, but it's actually been about three days. Uh, that's how long it took these guys to hatch. Um, I don't know if it's because of what I did, uh, the water wasn't optimal or what, but uh, as you can see now, there's just, I mean, hundreds and hundreds, who knows, maybe thousands of these guys in here. Uh, so what I'm going to do next is I'm going to take, uh, I'd say maybe like 50% of these guys and put them in an actual tank uh, so that they can grow to adulthood uh, and see if maybe... We can get a continuous flow of these guys going. Um, so what I've done is I had a 2.5 gallon tank from a beta fish that I used to keep laying around. Um, I'm going to actually try to set up um, something that I can actually raise them to adulthood for my fish. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to transfer the baby's over and what I've done is I've put in a little heater in the airline so that we could have movement in the tank as well I mean there's tons of these little suckers you know I'm trying to collect them without sucking up too many bags Just in this little thing right here. So. I don't want to put too many in here because I was told that if you put too many in here, uh, your tank will actually crash because there's so many and there's no space to swim. So I think I'm going to leave it at that. And then the rest of them, I'm probably going to feed them to my fish and my coral and stuff like that now. you can see that but there's just so many of these little guys I went and I picked up this spirulina powder from GNC uh, due to this big outbreak that we're having right now it's hard to find some stores that are even open so I had to travel I would say you know 30 minutes one way and then 15 minutes another way until I finally found the store that was actually open <clears throat> and what I'm told with this is that you don't want to feed a lot of it I mean, just a very very little amount goes a long way uh, it goes into the water column and I guess they eat it that way. So. Scoop this up. And let's, uh, you know, see what happens. Hopefully these guys in a you know, few weeks, I guess, get raised to become full adults. Yeah. And I will keep you guys posted. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate the support. If you'd like to see another update, please subscribe and that'll be great.